Hi, Aliyah. Thank you for joining us today. Hi, great to be here. So we've been discussing the possibility of Deb Haaland becoming the Secretary of the Interior and how important that confirmation would be. Can you tell us what's been the reaction so far? I have only seen very positive things on incoming Interior Secretary Deb Holland. Yesterday, in particular, social media was just beaming with pride and nothing but good thoughts. Um, and so it was just a very exciting day to report um, on what everyone had to say. There was reactions from, um, you know, parents posting that their children were jumping up and down to um, even elders saying what a huge historic monumental day. So everything in that range. When I, I saw two, just some people posting, you know, this is the first time they've seen someone that looks like them uh, in a role like this. What will Secretary Holland's new role entail? Well, essentially, um, she will be um, the caretaker of the nation's public lands and waters. And this is the first time in U.S. history that an Indigenous person um, has held this position, but also has been on a president's cabinet. And so, essentially, she'll do and work on a wide range of um, topics, everything from conservation to natural resources, and she'll also oversee a uh, group of key offices for Indian country um, specifically, including the Bureau of Indian Education and the Bureau of Indian Affairs. Given Secretary Holland will be overseeing the country's land and water, do you think some of her decisions are going to put her at odds with the wishes of tribes on different issues? Is this going to be a balancing act for her? I think that's what a lot of people are sort of expecting. I know that off the top of my head, I've heard a lot of sources say um, that at the very least, they are very confident with having and uh, having Secretary Holland in office that um, tribal consultation will be respected. And so at the very uh, minimum, that means having conversations with tribal leaders and inviting them to the table. And so I think that's a great start there. And we'll certainly be uh, watching as things go forward. Thank you again, Aliyah, for joining, with us, joining us today. Thanks for having me.